Hello, second time trying to record this, and yeah. I'm not, like, angry, I'm actually kind of happy that I'm doing this, because I actually like this star a lot. I'm just not amazing at it, but it's not that bad. The only difficult part is, like, getting the angling down, which I don't remember. I've done it, like, a couple of times, like, almost reached the stone pillar, but I haven't, like, been able to actually reach it yet. I think it was, like, right here. Oh, come on! Yeah, one, like, one minute per attempt, really. Oh my god. Why is this level so laggy? Were there and was there anything interesting I said on the last attempt at recording this? Not really. There might have been one or two things, but I don't remember them, so they couldn't have been that interesting. Although I seem to remember only dumb stuff. By dumb I mean like things I regret saying. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. Basically, I was talking about how... So now there are going to be two randomly appearing stars in a row. Basically, collect the caps and quick race through downtown. I'm not sure in which order. But, yeah, I'm getting Pyramid Puzzle last, definitely. That deserves to be the last star in the CCC run. It deserves it. I'm not even joking. Ugh. Gotta love, uh, this level. Ugh. Do I have to be C down, or can I also be C up? I think C up may work. I don't entirely... I think you may have to be C up, like, just regular C. There we go. Wow. Whatever, I got it. And only 316 in this video. Interesting. I got it. Like, I don't really want to try anything else right now. But So I'm going to save and quit. First, I'm going to uh, do... I didn't show this in the last segment. Like, in this segment, but I did in the failed attempt. Every time I get a new star now, I'm going to copy it to that file, basically. Completely coinless. So I guess now we'll try collect the caps. Because that one's not too difficult. I wasn't expecting it to like be that easy. I guess you'd be on regular Lakitu. I don't remember that. But I guess that helped. I mean... All the other times I tried it on C down, I either couldn't do the long jump properly or I couldn't wall kick properly. But the one time I tried it on regular C, I got it. I'm not sure if it was luck or skill. Either way, I got it. So let's try collect the caps, because this is a very interesting one. So basically, if you haven't watched my Super Mario 64 CCC videos playlist, this collect caps is completely possible to do. Completely possible. It's just weird because it's another version of the Chuck glitch where thing you bring something past a loading point, and the only thing you can bring past it is the shell. But normally, the shell wouldn't make it long enough to last to get the star. So to do it, you have to press B when getting to the surface, and then you should be able. Then you should get it. 
Like, if you do it right, you'll take the thing on land, and yeah. Like, let's see if I can do it. I haven't done this, like, at all. I only done this, like, once. Nope, I screwed it up. And every time that happens, it doesn't reappear, so you have to exit the course. Lovely. But yeah, I've only done it on console, was it once or twice? Twice. But yeah. I'm not gonna try this for too long. If I can't get the glitch going, like, after, like, a couple of tries, I'll just end the segment and do it in the next video. But if I can get it, I guess I'll keep going on. Uh, the Chucky glitch in uh, Wet Dry World is going to be amazing to pull off. Yeah. Let's try this again. Okay. No. Did I fail? That took over a minute to do. Are you serious? One attempt takes over a minute. That is crazy. Yeah, this isn't the easiest glitch in the world to pull off. It's not completely difficult, so you just have to have the right timing. And preferably a really nice camera angle, but you can't have all of those things. A camera angle so like you know when you're at like the surface and stuff, so yeah. Um, if I don't get it this time, the next attempt will be my last. Because I've achieved what I what my goal was for the segment already. So no, come on. This isn't that difficult. I just don't remember, like, how to do it. Like, what angle I have to go up and then to the surface. It's just kind of... I don't know how to explain it. So yeah, this is my last attempt if I don't get it, so... Let's hope I get it. Then this will be wasted time. That I probably won't edit out because the video is currently short in length. So yeah, the other, the last one was short, but let's like I don't want to talk about that last segment. It was really bad. I got very weird, as is obvious by the post commentary and the first thing I said of the video. Where's the dumb shell? Actually, the shell's not dumb. It's actually pretty cool. Underwater. It's just, like, completely underutilized and has no purpose. To be honest, it doesn't. It doesn't have any practical purpose. I guess it's just, like, a novelty item. Okay, I got it. Yeah, you just have to press B when you're, like, exactly in the, like, when you're about to go on to land. You just have to have to have the right angle so you know, like, where you are, and then press B at the right time. Yeah, now I'm almost, like, dead. But the loading point is just here, so... Yeah. Let's hope it doesn't take forever to, uh, turn into the star. It disappeared, as you can tell. Oh, I think it turned into a different star. No, it turned into nothing. Oh, there's a pole! Invisible. Maybe he's holding some sort of coin. Ooh! A block. Okay, a pole again. Block again, okay. Ah. Because if he's holding a coin, you can't, won't really be able to see it. Pull again, okay. 
Why isn't it changing it to like any of the plants or anything? I wonder if you do this glitch while the sub is still there, can it- Oh, there's red coin. Can it turn into the sub? If it did, it'd be like, amazingly laggy. Wait, am I holding something or not? I th I'm holding something, I don't know what though. Oh, finally a plant. Oh, the shell's back! Hooray! What it originally was. Plant again. Oh, I don't know what that is. It's something weird. Block again, okay? Oh, I, I am the shark. That is awesome. It reminds me of Kaizo Mario 64 and the giant wall of sharks. I should really like. Oh, switch. Like, see what all these different items are. Like, using, like, Toad's tool or something. Block again? Okay. Like, you can have fun just doing this glitch, seeing what it turns into. You can have so much fun. again, okay. I hope I get the star soon, my leg's starting to cramp up. Uh, what is that I'm holding? Holding something. Or am I? I don't know. Plant again, okay. That thing again, whatever it is. Oh, now, wherever I was holding it was this flat. Okay. Hold again. I know I'm saying these like really late, but whatever. Hold. Like, I, I bet they're not turning into. Hold on, I need to like move a little. Uh, I know they're probably not turning into the same pole. There are several of those, but yeah, still. Pole. And now a box. Ooh, tornado! That's nice. Star! There we go. That didn't take too long, actually. That took about six, seven minutes, I think. Collect the caps. Let's save and quit. Let's do this again. Look at the score. So I want to get this on video after every star. Hooray! So, Mom's Fortress, have all five. Thank you. Uh, Jolly Roger Bay, have all five. Hooray! Dire Dire Dogs, have all five! That's amazing. So, next segment, we'll be doing the Wet Dry World star. And let me do one more thing before I end. Just so I don't have to do this in the next segment. Oh, wait. Copy here to the here. Okay. Goodbye.